manufacturing department, Maureen Lundman in the sales department, Darlene Brinster, our office manager, Ginny Wynn, our inventory tech. And so we have a lot of continuity and we sometimes talk about our own tribal knowledge. At the same time, we're welcoming newcomers, very interested in growing and expanding the company. So we're, we're working to share our, our knowledge and, and, and uh, build the company into a, an even better resource for the state and the community and, and uh, our markets. The pump line, the, the Chrysophily pump, with its centrifugal pump, which jumps the banks of the, of the Yellowstone River to irrigate along the river, and that's the way it was originally designed. So you take that pump and then you stand it up and you have a vertical pump, and then you make that into a permanent installation. Or you put it on a floating platform and you've got a dredge, and you add some automation and you add an auger and a cutter head, and all of a sudden, you're, you just have all sorts of markets. You're, you're out selling to food processing plants and clean water and wastewater and mines. We, we have customers who are uranium mines. We have customers who are coal mines. We, we, we're shipping this month to Mali and, and Australia and Chile. So we're able to, from a fairly remote, rural, location in Montana, manufacture, engineer, collaborate with people all over the world, and ship really fine product. Most people, I think, if they thought of uh, a manufacturing firm, it's all guys that do everything from start to finish. But it sounds like your lead salesperson is a woman. She is. Um, I'd have to say that, that uh, our shop floor has even been integrated from time to time. Uh, so we're pretty open-minded about who should or can do what. Uh, Maureen, who's been with us over 20 years, has worked in the sales department. Started in, manuf in, in started in um, started as a secretary, of course, but that's back in the day and then develop skills in marketing and then she's just taken on sales and and done a great job with it folks stay with us that's montana will be right back and we will meet this incredible lady right nice. after this a home is more than just a building it's a refuge from the outside world a place where families can feel safe and secure at stockman bank we enjoy helping montanans build and own their own homes and we treat borrowers like friends and neighbors, because they are. Treating people with respect, care, and a personal touch is the Montana way. It's the only way we know. Stockman Bank. Montana Banking. Pure and simple. That's Montana. We'll be right back. Maureen, take us back in time. You've been with Chris Foley almost since day one. Give us a history of that organization. Who started it and the purpose and where you are now? I came to the company in 1984. It actually was founded 20 years before that when the Chris Foley brothers put the first trailer mounted PTO driven tractor pump into the Yellowstone River to irrigate the bottomlands. And, uh, um, since then, the company has changed substantially. We've, uh, we serve a broader clientele, industrial customers, municipal customers, around the world now. And still kind of the family feel as far as the work is concerned. Indeed we do. Uh, many, of our, many of our staff who built the product have been with the company for many years over 20 years, some for a quarter of a century like me, and um, we are still family owned in a, in a way. The Memohard family bought the company in 1982, and they have uh, elected to keep it here in the Big Sky State. 
I know you won't want to uh, toot your own horn, but as I understand, you're the lead salesperson for that manufacturing organization. Well, I've had the good fortune to be the salesperson who has uh, worked with the most international clientele. We now have uh, sold our, our dredge systems and pumps in 42 countries worldwide. And the fact that I handle most of our international clientele has, has helped me um, grow in sales. All based out of Montana. That's, that's correct. Most of our international clients find us via our website. They come to us because they have a problem that our equipment can help them solve. You know, they have solids settling in their process lagoons or treatment lagoons and, and our dredge systems, which is a product that has developed over the years. It's essentially a very large floating pump. Um, our, our products can help them solve their problems. Just like good old Montana things all the way around. Good Montana know-how. <laughs> Maureen, thank you very much. You're very welcome, John. Well, that puts a wrap on this episode of That's Montana. We want to thank the folks at Chris Afoli Pump in Glendive, along with extension agent Bruce Smith. Don't forget to visit our website at www.thatsmontana.com and also join us on Facebook. We'll see you next Sunday on That's Montana. That's Montana has been brought to you by Stockman Bank, Montana Banking Pure and Simple. BNSF Railway, we live here, we work here, and we're proud of it. Taylor's Auto Group, where everything we do, we do for you. Billings, Montana's Trailhead. Plan your stay at visitbillings.com.